Hey everyone, it's Vinny, and today we're looking at the private term stakes at Laurel Park this Saturday, March 18th. It's race number nine, and it is a mile and a sixteenth for three-year-olds. Now, I don't think any of these runners will be in the Kentucky Derby starting gate, but you never know. They run big here. They might Connections might attempt to try one of the 100-point preps coming up in the next few weeks. There's eight runners signed on for this, so let's get into it. The first horse on my list to discuss is a, the horse breaking from the far outside in the eight hole. It is Coffee with Chris. Already has 10 career starts, which is a lot uh, looking at the rest of this field. But he does have two stakes wins here at Laurel Park. Uh, he beat a few of these runners already uh, back in February in the Miracle Wood stakes. I think there's really only three horses here that have a legitimate shot of winning unless somebody takes a massive step up. He is one of them. I think he's probably going to be be heavily bet because he has won a couple stakes races. He's 7 for 10 career finishing in the money. He's my third choice. I think he is beatable. Um, I think the other two that I'm going to discuss have more of an upside. So for that reason, Coffee with Chris is my third choice, but I don't expect him to run a bad race here. The second horse I want to discuss is Circling the Drain for Brittany Russell. Four starts, two wins, and two seconds here at Laurel Park, and won fairly easily last time out at this distance. This son of West Coast just keeps improving at every start. Another improvement, and I think he'll be pretty tough here. I'm just, I'm not sold on these West Coast runners really being, uh, really improving that much. So that's why I ended up putting this one second. I'm hoping that Circling the Drain is probably the best price of the three that I'm discussing, and for that reason, I uh, Circling the Drain will be on my tickets if, uh, if he is indeed the third choice out of these three horses. Uh, but my top pick here is shipping in from New York, uh, and that is register for David Donk. He's run three times as a three-year-old. He's got one win in two seconds, but that win was very impressive last time out. Uh, he's got early speed. He gets a jockey upgrade today to uh, Vargas, which I like. Vargas is aggressive, and uh, Register does have early speed, so I'm expecting him to be sent early. Not super thrilled about uh, a son of Super Saber going two turns. Uh, his last win was a mile at Aqueduct, so it's only one turn there. But if he gets out to an early lead uh, and can clear... I think this horse can be super dangerous. I also don't think Donk would ship him out of New York unless he was ready. So for that reason, I am using Registered on top for Donk. I am going 5-3-8 here in the private term stakes at Laurel Park this Saturday. Best of luck if you're playing, and I will see you next time. RacingDudes.com is your home for the best free picks for every race, every track across the country. We're ramping up for the 2023 Kentucky Derby, and we want you to join us in the fun. Subscribe to Racing Dudes' YouTube channel, like click the notification bell so you never miss a single video. Want to make money betting horses? Bet with the Racing Dudes.